pretty much. I'm literally had my eyes shut and my ears closed because even the sound. The sound is the worst sometimes. Yes, it gets you. It just like takes you places that you're like, maybe if I just wasn't hearing this, I can get through like, it. I don't want to go to that place. This place is too scary. It is crazy. You know, it happened to me too and I'm in the movie. I'm, yeah. I'm seeing my face up there and I'm like, oh God. And you and know what's going to happen too. Not knowing what's going to happen, oh, it takes you It takes you on a whole nother journey. Yeah, this film. I had my feet up on the seat in the cinema. I was like, oh, oh, oh. I think you can shoot this film by turning the camera and watching audiences and their reaction. So true. It's crazy. I would do that actually. I was like looking back and there were people just scarves yes. over their entire yes. faces. <laughs> yes, this movie will freak you out. It, it just had all, so many moments. Yeah. But one thing I also could appreciate and really liked is that outside of all the scary moments in the horror, I really got into these characters Me too. and what they were going through. Yeah. What did you see? How did you see your character? Oh, she's just complex, and I just felt for her. She's man, she has had her childhood ripped out from under her, and she's had this really intense dynamic with her mother for a very long time. And she's just, her mother's so mentally ill, and it's really hard for a child to grow up with a mentally ill mother. So I could definitely relate to that dynamic and I knew people like this in my life. I was like, I know this person, I know this. So for me to, to relate to the characters made the film feel so much more real. It was grounded in this, in this beautiful reality and it was there from the start. I read the script and I was like, oh, I'm hooked because I care about these people. Yes, and also shooting in that house as an actress. How was that, how was that for you? <laughs> the house was really creepy. It was a really scary house. No offense to the owner who's hopefully not watching. Um, but it was three stories of creepiness. And the bottom story never was used. It was actually a basement, but it was as, as large as the second and third story. So it was just these empty rooms, cold, dark, concrete rooms. And they had like the mannequins laid out in some of the back rooms, like with the scratched out faces. And uh, I mean, it's just scary. We, all of us felt uncomfortable in that house. Like the whole crew were like, let's stick together. Yeah, you literally will have to be paid to get in that film yeah. and to like shoot it. I can just imagine that was really nerve wracking. Yeah, so did you have a scariest moment in shooting this film? Huh, well, I think the basement sequences was really hard. And because I had to light a lot of that myself because I'm carrying the light around. So. There literally is no other lights down in the basement and, and everyone would have to turn their cell phones off and we shot and it was just this one light. And I was like, whoa, if this goes out, like we all uh, plummeted into darkness. And there was one point that I moved the left to the left instead of the right and I pulled the plug out because it was, it was down through my outfit plugged into the wall. And then everyone was like, oh, I could just hear the whole crew because it's so scary down there. Yeah. So Technically, you had a lot to do with that scene. You were like, it was on you. It was, and I remember the DP saying like, all right, you hold it here, it's pretty good. Here, it's perfect. Here is really bad. Do not do that. Because it like lights right up my nostrils. <laughs> and then I had to light like Gabriel, my little brother, and then I had to light the wall. And so I had so many notes, like hit this, light here, do that. It was so funny. Yeah, you know, I guess at that point, you don't have any time to be scared. I know. Hollywood. Hey guys, thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel, Made in Hollywood TV. Let us know what you think in the comment section below. And for the next awesome video, click right here. Click in that box right there, right there. Super easy.